Have you ever wondered why letters on any keyboard isn't arranged in alphabetical order? The location of the letters goes back to the 19th century typewriter. A typewriter is a machine for typing. The principle of its work is very simple. When you push the bottom of the letter, it activates a lever with the cast matrix of this letter on its top. This type of lever hits the ribbon soaked with ink, which occupies between the lever and the paper. That is how we get the print. While typing the text, lever hits the paper one by one. Year 1868, Christopher Scholes invented the first typewriter and it had the alphabetical arrangement of letters within two rows. And it is also known as a piano style keyboard. Only capital letters were allowed while numbers 1 and 0 were printed with the help of letter I and O. It was acceptable at the beginning, but later, this type of typewriter became problematic since the speed of typing grew. Some levers couldn't make it in time to take their initial places so fast, so they were clinging with one another. Year 1872 they had a new keyboard arrangement with the first hint of QWERTY. As you can see, the period or the full stop was soon moved to the bottom right. Year 1873, it was the first appearance of the almost modern, the QWERTY keyboard. There are only a handful of English words that can be spelled out using the top row of the keyboard. One of them is typewriter. It seems unlikely that this is a coincidence. Here, 1878, the QWERTY keyboard is improved again, apparently for no other reasons than to evade Scholl's patent. And this is now our modern QWERTY keyboard.